Spanish food is best known for its signature dishes, paella and gazpacho, and its seafood is to die for. But Spanish food is very diverse and can be enjoyed in small portions called tapas. These small appetizers are meant to be shared with family and friends and are part of the Spanish way of life. Tapas can be served before an entree, but often patrons order enough tapas to create a satisfying and filling dinner. For those that enjoy variety, the choices are endless. The selection of tapas vary greatly. Order several tapas, then enjoy them like the Spaniards do, with friends, a big glass of wine, and a relaxed attitude. Que rico! The two signature dishes of Spain are, of course, paella. Everybody loves paella. Paella is the national dish. And yes. gazpacho. And gazpacho. Which is one of my favorites. And nothing is better than summer. To me, gazpacho just rings summertime because I know that you just picked it fresh off the vine and you're making gazpacho. That's right. Pick everything from my garden, bring it over here, make the gazpacho, and there it goes. So let's talk a little bit about paella. Paella. What, what makes paella so special? National dish or Spain. Okay, paella is star in Valencia. Mm -hmm. It's where they grow the rice, okay? So they stop over there. They have about 20 different types of making rice, okay? But paella became the signature dish for Valencia or Levante, and then spread all over the Spain. Now, each region has their own different way of making paella, mm -hmm. their own different way. If you go to northern Spain, all seafood. Mm -hmm. They don't put any meat, they don't put any chicken, they don't put anything. Okay? Now you go to Madrid, it's like a paella mixta. It has chicken and has seafood. Now you go to Valencia and has pork and seafood. Okay? You know, you go to Catalonia and has sausage and seafood. So each region or each state, if you can say, it has their own signature dish on the paella, however they want to do it. For me, still the best one is the one in Madrid because it captures a little bit of everything. What kind of paellas do we have here? Well, this one that we have over here is the one I'm talking about. That is from Madrid. That is the Valenciana. Okay. Okay. And the Valenciana is the rice with seafood and chicken. So that's what we have over here. Let's talk yeah. a little bit about what is the story behind the tap. Well, actually, the tapas, it means to cover something. That's what the tapa means. And during the uh, many years ago, like over here in the United States, air condition was not there. So the doors were open for uh, to cool off and people serve sharing glasses like this. Mm -hmm. Okay. And the flies will get in, the bees will get in, and it's not the first time that somebody swallow a bee or a fly, okay? So they came up with the idea that you put something in top of your drink. So the flies and the bees cannot get in, okay? Mm -hmm. So you keep drinking, you put it back, okay? You drink, you finish, you eat the tapa. May I try? Sure. No!